our industry has been brainwashed into thinking that the equipment is the system when it's not, it's a component of the system. And static pressure is really, in my opinion, it's like that cornerstone that takes you from looking not just at the equipment, but looking to everything that it's attached to. And it's one of the easiest ways to get a conversation started on airflow, on the duct system, which is what you guys specialize in. Anybody can sell, insert manufacturer's name here's box. Anybody can if they'll sell it to you. But once you start to focus on the duct system, you start to focus on what you specialize in. You start to focus on what really delivers comfort. And I mean, you can hook up a 20 sear piece of equipment to a duct system in an attic that's under insulated, that's leaking. And instead of it operating as sear, it will operate as AFU because you're actually heating the home. So I mean, the duct system determines the efficiency of the equipment more than the equipment itself. So the equipment's not the system. You guys build the system. It's what you do every single day. And it's what separates. I know uh, I caught the tail end of Bill's answering a question about a referred contractor network. Now, that's mm-hmm. an awesome idea. But that's the whole mindset behind that is putting guys together who really focus on HVAC as a craft. And when you start to look at the air side, that's like the first step and to truly focus on what you do. And it's kind of scary because you're stepping out almost into the unknown, what you're not familiar with. And unfortunately, what's happened is manufacturers have turned us into manu- into really equipment repair guys. That's what we do. And when you start just taking static, it causes you to look that one step further. All it does is it takes you, shifts your perspective 90 degrees. And now you're looking at things in a completely different angle. And you'll start to see things that you never saw before. At least that's what it did for us. 